As we approach the holidays, you can help low-income families experience the joy of purchasing new Christmas toys and gifts for their children. Parents only pay 20% of the cost. And last year's Mission Waco Christmas Toy Store served more than 550 families, shopping for 1,700 children. Joining me now, John Calloway, Executive Director for Mission Waco. And you began the campaign for donations of the toys back in October, but you're still taking toys, right? Correct, we are. We've got a number of businesses that still have events uh, where people can come like there's a Steba Wealth Management, our good friends of Mission Waco, Eric and Ernie Steba, and they have an event coming up at the Hippodrome where a lot of their clients bring toys. And so we have lots of businesses and churches are still collecting a lot of toys uh, for our annual toy biker toy run ah, that's, that's going to happen. That's fun. I did that one year. I can't so believe it. Much. I love it. I've got to see a picture of that. <laughs> I, was, I really do. I was a Honda honey. That's what the helmet <laughs> said. At any rate, it was, it was so much fun because you knew all these toys were going for parents to, to be able to buy them. And I think that's key. Correct. I think uh, many of us who've participated in the past, like I have, with uh, giving families uh, gifts, like in their living room and at their homes, you notice that the dads usually aren't around. Uh, and we've noticed that they're not around because they're ashamed that they can't buy their own kids uh, gifts for Christmas. Mm -hmm. And so that's why we do uh, a little bit differently, have a different approach. And so we collect these toys. We still buy probably around thirty-five to forty thousand dollars worth of new toys. Uh, and then we sell those at 20% of the cost. And it allows that uh, uh, affirmation of dignity uh, for these moms and dads, because it's just as much about the parents shopping as it is kids getting gifts. And so it's so much fun getting to see these parents shop, and then we help them wrap the gifts with volunteers that participate in the, in the, in the weekend shopping uh, event. So it's a lot of fun. So this event is coming up when? The 13th and 14th okay, uh, is the event. We've already uh, maxed out the number of vouchers that we hand out. They go through a process where they learn about all the services and programs that Mission Waco provides. Um, and they sit through that, it's about an hour long, and then they get a, a ticket basically. Uh, and we have just over 500 families uh, that'll be participating that have their tickets already. And so uh, we're just gearing up, uh, trying to get toys moved over from the storage unit to where our toy store is gonna be at our children's center called The Rock. And so we're in full kind of toy uh, store setup mode. <laughs> but Thanksgiving is coming up. It is, we have a, an event for the homeless in our community, about 100 homeless that show up uh, to the Meyer Center, which is our one-stop shop for the homeless. And uh, we have 11 o'clock time of uh, fun and fellowship, uh, worship, and then we eat together with all the volunteers and folks who've showed up to serve uh, and participate. And then we have uh, a fun game of bingo afterwards that lasts an hour or two and get quite competitive uh, in the bingo world. And so that's a lot of fun. Um, and then that Sunday right after Thanksgiving is when we have about 100 bikers, as you mentioned, mm -hmm. go around uh, to about 20 different churches and pick up toys. Oh, it's wonderful. But if folks want to still give a toy, how do they do that? Uh, they can go online. We have an Amazon uh, wish list See, uh, that people easy. can I access. It's really easy. easy. Uh, but I always encourage, and I do this with my family, to go to, to a Walmart or a Target uh, and buy a gift yeah. with your family and let your kids experience that and bring it to our front office at Mission Waco. Uh, we, we're open till 5 p.m. most days. All right. Oh, John, thank you so much for everything you're doing in the community Thanks through Mission Waco.